Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy TT back in another video. Hope you guys are all doing well. I know I am. Where's all y'all? We still here. We still here and holding on. We are re rebuilding Los Angeles Lakers, and I don't even know how we're gonna do this. I don't know. Looks like Russ played decent. Kind as you can see, Lakers went 36 and 46. They did not make the play in or the playoffs, just like in real life. Frank, unfortunately, I'm sorry, man. Y'all, y'all know the saying. I'm sorry it had to be you, but it had to be you. Now, is this realistic at all? No. Not at all. I think Pop would do a backflip off a bridge before he coached for the Lakers. However, we have a defensive superstar in AD. We need to figure out how to make this a playoff team. I really want to get like a second round pick. Is that possible? Okay, yeah. So we can trade into the second round. I want to draft somebody because we need all the help we can get. You know what? Can I get two? And then a swap. Sure. So now we have two second round picks this year. We're going to draft with both of them. Hopefully, at least one of them can be a rotational player this season. And hopefully the other one is either a good trade piece or can be a rotational piece next season. Okay, so we have a big man here off rip. Francis Blake. Mm, he can contest and block at a high level. I like that. Post defense and rebound is what I need out of my big man. Oh, he's kind of good. He shoots threes, though, but he doesn't shoot them very good. Vin Barker, Roderick Rose. Oh, he looks nice. He's a 20-year-old Slovenian point guard. Poor finisher through traffic. He gets to the rim okay. Okay, he can finish, and he's a gone ball defender. He play makes. We're going to grab him. Wait, do I think he'll be here, though? I'm going to grab him to be safe because I don't know if he'll be here by the time we get to the 50th overall. We have who we got here? Joe Sampson. Eh. Poor reflexes. Ooh, that's not very good. What about Joe Pierce? Oh, Joe Pierce could be interesting. He's strong. He can block shots. He can score if needed. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and call up Joe Pierce, too. And he's young. There we go. So this is this is step one. We're bringing in young talent. Russ, of course, accepted his player option. Of course he did. Okay, but at least now we can trade him. He's officially a piece we can trade. This is interesting. Okay, we're going to put first. John, we can flip Terrence Ross to another team. That's not a problem. And then we'll get John Isaac. This could be helpful. But for a first, though, ooh, this is, this is kind of steep. Mm, is there any way, I mean, like, any way we can talk you into doing seconds instead? I don't want Wagner, so that's not beneficial to me. I literally don't want him. Like, you guys couldn't pay me to take him. I don't want him on my team. Hold on, hold on. We're on to something. We are on to something. We got them to offer this. We are taking this deal. Three seconds, we have to keep our first, and we're going to flip Terrence Ross. Okay, we're doing magic. We're doing we're doing some magic here. We can get a first-round pick for him. What kind, what kind of team offers a first-round pick for Terrence Ross? Like how down bad do you have to be to do this? Yeah, we're going to do it. We're, we're going to take this 2023 pick here. We're going to take it. See you, Terrence. And that should have shaved off a little bit of money. You were like just over. Qualifying offers, Mason Jones. I think he'll be beneficial to keep around. Winnie and Gabriel, not so much. We'll go ahead and pay up Kendrick Nunn. At worst, if he doesn't play good next year, he's a human trade exception. Can I get Eagle Dollar on the minimum? Yeah, we'll do that then. No, I didn't. We're going to go ahead and bring Gary Payton. We're going to give him a max two-year player option with it. Okay, here might be a little loophole. The Rockets waived Terrence Ross after we traded him there. So we could bring him back on a minimum, and we've much just got a free first-round pick. Braun has begun to go down. Taylor is still pretty good, though. Iguodala, Terrence Ross both fall off. Let's go ahead and go down here. Yeah, I, I actually scout two-way, guys. This is, the, what, the fourth video? Well, I don't know how you guys are going to see this, but it's either the third or fourth video you've seen of me. And I've literally never signed two-way, guys, because we never had to. This is easily the hardest one I've had to do. Free throw camp. You guys know about that. And we got perimeter shooting. I need THC to be able to shoot. Then perimeter shooting for Fultz. Yeah. Okay, so to start year one of the rebuild, we got Fultz, Gary Payton, Iguodala, Braun, AD, and then Nunn, THT, Tice, Joe Pierce, our rookie, <laughs> and Austin Reeves. Okay, and we're going to send him to the G League while he's not in the rotation. Because I have a feeling we're going to need him sooner than then late we lose an ot in game one 35 and 15 by shea ad dominated though okay if we get mvp ad this could work this could definitely work 
We need we need to get MVP AD. To, whoa, what did THT? Oh yeah, if they play good, we could we can be in a good spot. We have to do this deal. Okay, I was looking. This deal it just makes too much sense. I'm gonna look just just to say I looked. I'm gonna say I looked around. Yeah, we look. Wait, did I go 22? Let me go 22. I'm gonna be an honest man. Okay, we're doing this deal right here. You're, we are giving up first. We have Kendrick Nunn and we have Taylor Horn Tucker going out, but we're getting 100% better and we need the talent desperately right now. Okay, I like this. I think I will keep Tyus as a backup point guard, though. I will. How did Matt Thomas do? Yeah, he was doing good. We, we Yes, that's how, that's how down bad we were getting. We had to put Matt Thomas in the rotation. In our in our uh, second round pick, this is why you trade for like. Look at the he's cold. He's better than a guy I got early at, at the, the first overall in the second round. He's better than him. So I'm like, go figure. I think we're gonna put Braun at small forward though. Here, hold on. Yeah, we're gonna go put Braun at small forward. Oh look, the, the Bucks are trying to give me the Frank dude I was talking about, and he's good. Oh, I fumbled. I should have took him. It's an evil world we live in. Yeah, so we signed Bembry out of free agency. We're gonna see how he can do in these backup minutes here. Yeah, why why does I always give y'all so many minutes? Need Matt Thomas a couple more minutes. Need you to have a couple more minutes. And then Luca is your MVP. Richie Riley Wiley? Riley? Was that Riley or Wiley? Riley is your rookie of the year. He didn't make rookie first team or second team. He hooped. Ekbe Udo just switched positions he was hooping look at look at what my rookie did this is like literal robbery the man put up 13 and 4 and he shot 39 percent from three he was shooting them things where he was shooting them things like yeah, it wasn't like he was being cheap with it we are the eighth seed okay so they're the regular warriors team come on let's make the playoffs we made the playoffs let's freaking go we're not gonna blow that lead we're not i would ship out every person on this team they're not crazy. Look at that. Look, yeah, he's the future. He, he's the future for real. We're going against the Pelicans in the first round. AD, my man, it's time to get your revenge. It is time. Yeah, literally my minimum guys clutched up. Okay, not, not maybe not him. But the rest of my minimum guys clutched up. I would not be here without them. Amen. And yeah, we're going to give those to AD. Yeah, I want AD on the court on almost the entire game. And Liz Zion Cook. We're going to make him guard him, too. Yeah, you're going to do all this, AD. Yeah, we just got demolished. No one even went crazy, though. The whole team just bodied us. Yeah, okay, so we're down 2-0. We're down 2-0. I'm not sure what we need to do. What about if we start John Isaac? I like the spacing, though. Here, we're going to start Matt Thomas and John Isaac. So now we're going to get shooting and then our defense back. Okay, let's try that. We got John Isaac to guard Zion, and it didn't it didn't do much apparently. Yeah, he put up thirty and fourteen on his head top, but A AD's doing his part at least. AD and Brown doing their thing. Matt Thomas came out and hooped. I'm bringing back Matt Thomas. Believe that. Matt Thomas and Damian Jones are coming back to next year's team. Yeah, we got swept. That's freaking great. Ooh, he was jacking them things up. He had ten free throws though. LeBron retired. I have no idea what we're about to do. I'm not gonna change it though. The thing with these rebuilds is I don't want to change fate. We missed the playoffs twice, and Braun was like, I'm I'm too old for this. I'm going to see y'all next, next time around. Oh, we're the seventh from the Rockets. I didn't see that. Oh, we can do something. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, man. If Paul George wasn't about to fall off this year, I would 100% do that. But I know he's going to like do a backflip off of a cliff, and he's going to be like an 81 overall in a minute. So I'm not touching that. What are we going to do without Braun? I'm really just I'm thinking about this. What are we going to do? Our team's not good. We don't have picks. Like, <laughs> what are we about to do? I don't know. Okay. We're going to go down here to the seventh. We're going to see what's up. And this Rockets pick that we got was actually from last year's deal to get Terrence Ross, I believe, that they ended up waving anyway. So I was like, that's kind of crazy, but okay. We get this guy, Cody Lawrence. He's a defensive two guard that can't shoot. We compare him to Danny Green. Very good defender. Deadly accurate jump shooter? Uh from where? Miles Bridges. But his shot tendency is awful. We're doing this. De'Aaron Fox has asked out. We're giving him the seventh overall pick and the twenty-sixth overall pick for 
Damn, like yeah, this is crazy. I don't know why this even came up, but yeah, we're doing this. I'm not even looking the rest of the way. No, we have our help now. I want to bring back Tyus Jones. I don't want uh Fultz anymore. Fultz, get on out of here. We're gonna figure this out. We got Terry Rozier for a second. We'll do that. Ooh, Clint would be nice though. Hmm. I'm gonna put AD at the four. Yeah, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do this one actually. Peyton and Bembry both declined. I'm keeping both of them. Yeah, we're keeping both of our guards here. Matt Thomas. I I, I like him. Reeves. I'm uh, he he was not good for two years in a row. I don't know. What we'll, we'll bring him now, but we might Jones. Where's Jones? No, tell me you're lying. Where is he? We can't pay him. Hold on, hold on. No, no. Don't do this. Player option, no trade clause. Okay, so we can get him. That's fine with me. We can't trade him now, but it's fine. Progression time. AD's officially the best player on our team. Let's see how that goes. We got De'Aaron Fox, Capella, Jones, Isaac still on the team. Our backup point guard's going crazy. Uh, yeah, let's have a look. Uh, Javante fell off. We're going to end up waving him. Sucks. Free throw camp. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and then we need big man offense for AD. We, you got you to gotta go cook this year. And then we're going to go combo guard for De'Aaron. Because, like, we're depending on these guys that make... Oh, yeah, I forgot. Waving Javante. Sorry, man. All right, so our rotation. To start the season, we're going to have De'Aaron. We're going to have Matt Thomas, John Isaac, AD, and Clint all starting. 6'11", 6'10", 6'10". That's some height. We got Tyus Jones off the bench. Joe Pierce, uh, Frank the Tank, and then Juan Toscano and Gary Payton. Both four of them are Warriors. Let's go and see how we look for this minute. And as we finish the year here... We have 53 and 29. That's everything. Frank Vogel's revenge. <sighs> Frank Vogel's revenge. So he's an Eastern Conference coach now? Who? I got to go see who. So he wants to go coach the Pistons. We're the third seed. We're going up against the Kings. De'Aaron Fox, it's your turn. It's your turn to get your revenge, man. I'm not even sure what to do here. Frank Kaminsky was so awful this year. He got better towards the end, but he still wasn't good. And yeah, Matt Thomas fell off towards the end. That's why he, he's out of the rotation right now. I think what we're going to do, we're going to make him a center. We're going to make Joe a center. Let's go. Game one. Come on, Lake Show. We, we got to get out the first round. Thank you. We win game 50. We traded for the right dude. We traded for that guy. He's literally that guy. Come on. 54. And we win game two, 28-9. Yeah. This is how we do it. Again. And we win in overtime. Let's go, Anthony Day. Come on, man. Please don't make me bench you, AD. Like, I will literally pull you out this lineup. Joe Pierce will take your spot. We're up 3-0 right now. Come on. Let's close this out. AD, just get a bounce back game. Get some rhythm for next, next uh, series, hopefully. Please, AD. AD like, we're, not, we're not doing this, bro. Thank you. Okay, we get out of here. 28 and 12. He still shot bad, but 28 and 12. We'll take the counting stats. We're going against. So it's either the Pelicans or the, I don't even know. Who who would you rather have there? Who who do you want? Who would you rather have? Both of those teams are going to be dominant. Uh, Game one. We're getting destroyed. Okay, yeah. So we got absolutely pummeled. Or, are we going to lose the Pelicans two years in a row? Like, say it ain't so. Please say it ain't so. We lost back-to-back -back games. Yeah. What What is this? Why are they so hard? Like, now AD's guarding him. If AD cannot guard him, no one on this team can guard him. It's that simple. Like, literally, if AD cannot hold him, no one is going to guard him. You're not playing well. You're playing okay. You're doing fine. You're not playing good, but we're not taking you up. You know what? We will. We will reward good players. We're going to let him make his, his debut in a playoff series. Hey, and it's looking good. Hey, we need to start doing this more often. He had 34 and 10 that game. Matt Thomas did okay. And he did okay. Six points and six assists with three steals. That's not bad. Come on. Come on. Tie the series up. Yeah, we tied the series up. He's cold. We should have been playing him. He's cold. Okay. I told y'all it was a secret weapon for later. Y'all didn't want to believe. We're, we're literally, our season is being saved. By our second round picks. You understand? That's how big brain I was. I was thinking about winning a championship years ago. We're going to game seven. Oh man. <laughs> oh man. Um, I don't even know. I don't even what do, what do we do here? I don't know. I don't even know. Who do we're leaving it? 
We are leaving it how it is. We are going into this and we're going to live with the result. Please. No. Uh, I don't want. Well, we got this merch. Pistons. So Frank Vogel won a championship before we could get it out. We're trading Tyus because he has a no trade clause too. And we, so he's cool with being traded right now. I'm not, I'm not going down that rabbit hole again. We're not. We're just not. What about you two together? And a center. That's perfect. I don't want that center, though. We are going to take that center. I lied. We're getting out of here. Like, I'm not, I'm not even. Yeah, we're bringing him in. We're not focused on this. AD accepted it. That's perfect. We're going to pick up your option solely because we want. So he's tradable now. Thibble. Yeah, I like that. Okay, TJ McConnell. He's going to get worse, though. But on a minimum, we'll take him. Frank, and hopefully we get a better backup five, or we get like a shooting guard. That's like the two things I'm looking for. Looney, Looney can do what I need him to do. We're bringing him in. Josh Hart would make a lot of sense for what I need. Well, that would have been very helpful to see a minute ago, but oh well. Okay, we're gonna bring in Josh Hart. We're having a reunion. There's Joe Pierce, and there's my yeah. They both picked it up. Perfect. AD, he's declined a little bit. Our backup point guard's going crazy. I knew it was the right move to pick him over Jones for the future. We got Clint going up. I don't, I don't know if I just said that. Healed still good. Pierce went up a little bit. Peyton's falling off. And all of our young, I mean, our young guys, all of our old vets off the bench are, are all falling off. All right, so you already know free throws. And then I'm thinking combo guard for De'Aaron. And I'm thinking big man defense for our power forward. Where are you? Or he's a center now. But he's going to be a power forward in a second. Okay, so our, our lineup for this final season, we got De'Aaron, Josh Hart, John Isaac, AD, and Capella. Then we got my boy Sasa. We got Buddy. We got Kevon Looney, Joe Pierce, and Gary Payton. That's going to be our rotate. Hey, we're running with this. <sighs> I'm pulling the trigger on this right here. We're going to bring in Gordon Hayward. I'm not confident about this. and It's kind of gross. I don't, but he's not playing good at all. So we're going to do this. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make buddy healed back to a shooting guard and as we finish here we are at 56 and 26 lucas still your mvp but we did have six to man the year my boy yeah but this is his first season so he he didn't okay sure i guess i don't care we're not arguing about this jb bickerstaff so we tie with somebody it appears we're going against we got a elderly steph wiggins and we got progressed kuminga and James Wiseman and the Lawrence dude that I almost drafted. So let's see how this goes. And we're going to go ahead and pull away with game one. That's a dominant fashion. Look at, uh, man, we're just like AD, bro. Let's look at stats. I, I, I didn't do that this whole video. I just realized that. No, not playoff stats. I'm like, well, he averaged 40 on the year. He was, he was out here 25 and seven on pretty decent splits. AD had 24 and nine. He had, what was that? A block and a half a game. 15 and 7 for our man off the bench. Buddy Heald had 12. He shot 46% from three. Capella 11 and 11. Pierce had 10 and shot 37% from three. Hey, where we trade for midseason? Isaac had a very Isaac game. Uh, Josh Hart, he was shooting 40% for, for quite some time. So, meh. And that's everybody at the end. No one else, any of these guys ever played. So, we'll keep rolling. 1 0, 1 1. Let's simulate one more. Are we really going to do this? And I already know who it is. Ooh, okay. You're, you're kind of playing good. Never mind. Ooh, did Fox fall off? I think, yeah, it was, it was Fox. Fox kind of fell off. We're, we're going to stay, stay here. We're going to stay here. If we, if we do not win a championship, that's fine. I'm going to live with it. But, yeah, we're... Come on. Okay, we, we, win, we win that game. Okay. We need to figure out something. Hart, what are you... Hart's not even playing bad. That's what we're going to do. Yep, that's what we're going to do. Yes, that's what we're going to do. Here we go. Let's try now. So we got some extra scoring in the first unit, and it wasn't enough. We do fall in the first round. Everyone just, like, come on, bro. Like, really? Well, guys, <laughs> I could not save the Lakers franchise, unfortunately. Uh, let me know if you guys want to retry this, though, because this was actually kind of interesting because how difficult it was. I mean, it, all it did was become more unrealistic. But, I mean, yeah, y'all let me know. I did snag with this second round pick and the other one. They both were cold. Where's he at? Pierce. He shot 44%. Yeah. You know what? Thanks for taking time out today. Stay and watch me. My hoops. Hey, hope you have a great rest of your day. It's your boy CT and I am out. Peace.